I did a video recently on Sister Wives, and I said that in retrospect, rewatching season one and two, I'm having some questions about the idea of having to leave Utah because they were under risk of being arrested, that they were in so much danger. And at the time when I first saw it, I thought, yeah, this is legit. In retrospect, I'm a little bit like, was this played out for the storyline? And I shared that view here. And uh, a lot of people were like, oh, yeah, it was totally for storyline. I thought I was going really out on a limb with this idea. But a lot of people were like, ah, I don't really buy it. I think it was partially for the TV show. I think Cody just wanted to move. And any time the idea of a move comes up, he's like, I'm on board. That's evidenced by someone said they've moved, I don't know, a billion times. We've seen them move. I mean, he sure loves to move a lot. But my question is, a lot of these comments came out and said, yeah, all five of the adults lied to us and the kids about the move. They didn't need to move. And that kind of surprised me because I hadn't really thought about it. I was thinking of it as Cody because Cody was clearly pushing this move. He was the agenda. And then a lot of people pointed out that Robin had family in Las Vegas and that she was this big proponent that maybe she was also behind it. Not to make this whole into a whole Robin thing. But my question to you is, do you think that if the move was not, if the move wasn't required for their safety, because a lot of people say there's, everyone knows that there's tons of polygamists in Utah and they, they stay there because of community, their entire church, like if the police really wanted to go after polygamists, they could go after polygamists. And that just doesn't seem to be happening unless there's something like welfare fraud, which I mean, maybe the Browns were involved in. Or um, that was all before the show. I don't know. But like child brides and stuff. But otherwise, it's just one of those things they just kind of go like maybe jaywalking. And we know it, but we're not really going to like fight a legal battle over it. But if that was the case, were they all, were all, did all of the adults knew this and move? Did Cody know this and move? Did Cody get some of the other wives scared? And so they were willing to move because like, I'll just take Christine, for example. She has family trauma from this. You know, she grew up this way. It scared her. Mary grew up scared. They both have a lot of childhood. Daddy's going to be taken away stuff. Did did, were, did they know that they were moving? Um, you know, or, or did Cody trick them into it? What is your opinion? I don't have an opinion yet. I haven't even finished watching the second season. I don't really know. But I was interested with how many people were like, yeah, all of the adults lied about having to move and me thinking I don't think all the adults wanted to move I think a lot of them wanted to stay